A pulley has a small rotating wheel in the center. When a rope runs through the groove, it creates mechanical tension. For example, using a fixed pulley to lift an object doesn't reduce the force needed, but it changes the direction, so you don't have to lift straight up. Due to friction, the force required is slightly more than the object's weight. Flip the pulley with the rope anchored above and attached to the object below. That's a movable pulley. Now, only half the force is needed because the weight is shared between two rope segments. Let's break it down. There's a downward force of 1,000 newtons, balanced by two upward forces of 500 newtons each. One rope end is fixed, the other only needs to pull with 500 newtons to lift the object. So one movable pulley saves half the effort, but you have to pull twice the distance. Add another movable pulley, now four rope segments share the load. You only need to pull with 250 newtons. Too many pulleys take up space. What's the solution? Smart designers combine fixed and movable pulleys into a block and tackle. Add enough movable pulleys and you can lift 100 tons with just a gentle pull, assuming no friction. If physics had been taught like this, you probably would have scored A+. Plus.